Hey, what's up guys, back with another video. Today I'm going to show you how to use green screen on OBS. Uh, so, um, this isn't really uh, hard at all. It's super easy actually. Uh, works on any image, uh, camera, or video, it doesn't matter. Let's get right to it. First, of course, you're going to have to click the plus sign. It's going to say display capture, game capture, it doesn't matter. But I'm using I'm gonna use an image for this. If you're gonna use like a uh what was it? Like a webcam, then you have to click on uh uh I don't have it because I don't have a webcam right now. But for now I'll just pretend that image is the webcam and uh actually display and then it's gonna show you of course how the webcam looks like you press ok so let's pretend this is the webcam and all that uh... What is this? orange shirt kid pretend this is the webcam press ok uh... for example you're gonna be there and you're gonna have to have to like a a white or a blue or a green background but it has to be like a color it can't just like be half or be like green and half is white. It's not gonna work. It can't be. There could be shadows, but it might look a bit bad. But I chose an image where it's like pure green. So first you right click, then filters, and here you're not gonna see anything because you have to click on the plus sign. Then you're going to have to go to chroma key, press OK, and as you can see, it will then be like that. If you're using like a white screen, you can only use these colors for like a green screen. If you don't have a green screen, you can use blue or mag magenta, I don't know how to pronounce that, or custom. And uh, if you're going to be using a white screen, you have to press custom and then select color and you have to go all the way to white. Then you press OK and as you can see, the kid will disappear. Oh my gosh. But I'm going to be using a green screen instead. Then once you do that, press close, and there you go. You have a green screen like, yeah. See? And that's how you do it. For more tutorials, subscribe. I will be uploading some more tutorials. Like, now that I'm using Sony Vegas 14 to edit, uh, which is this, Sony Vegas Pro 14. Yeah, I'm using that to edit for now on, so I'll be making, like, better made videos, so. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video.